Long, long ago, since the ancient time, humans have exploited the fermentation process. The common food that has been fermented, which is sauerkraut by Germany and in China, their fermented soy sauce and tempeh. But don't forget, in the Middle East, they use fermentation to make pickles, or we call jeruk nowadays. Fermentation occurs when unicellular organisms such as yeast consume sugar and convert them to alcohol and carbon dioxide over the course of several weeks. But that is then. And how about now? So why not we go to the future? Ever wonder why the bread is so fluffy? Hmm, let me think. Consider this as a yeast. The yeast remains unactivated as long it doesn't contact with warm water. But once it contact with warm water, it reactivated. The yeast then will eat the sugar in the flour. It keeps eating, eating the sugar, eat and eat and eat the sugar. And then, it will produce carbon dioxide. Ooh. Have you ever wondered where the studies of fermentation start from? We present to you Louis Pasteur. Louis Pasteur was the French chemist who founded Simology. When studying fermentation of sugar to alcohol by yeast, Louis Pasteur concluded that the fermentation was catalyzed by a vital force called ferments within the yeast cells. The ferments were thought to function only within living organisms, not the death or putrefactions of the cell. Additionally, microbial function. Let's be check out the other function in microbiology in food processing. Let's watch the bulletin now. Hi, welcome back to another episode of Microbiology Bulletin. 
First and foremost, today we will discover about the microbial function in food processing. So today, our greatest guest today is Dr. Stranger from Marvel Institution. Hi, Dr. Thank you for the question. Okay, let me explain. The main starter culture in yogurt are Lactobacillus bulgaricus and Streptococcus thermophilus. The function of the starter culture is to ferment lactose to form, to form lactic acid. The increase in lactic acid reduces the pH of the milk to clot or to form soft gel that is characteristic of a yogurt. That's all. So that's the end of our episode today. Meet you again in another episode of Microbiology Bulletin. Bye! So, do you enjoy the video? So, I hope we will learn something about the function of microorganisms in food processing. Bye! But that's not the only microbial function. Let's check out the other function of microbial. <laughs> Wait, microbiology. Take the tin. But that's not the only microbial function. Let's check it out the other function of microbiology in food processing. So, doctor, can you explain to me? Ah, the mat to me. Action. Okay. Thank you so much, doctor, for having us. Okay. Take five. But that's not the only microbial function. Let's check out the other function of microbial. <laughs> Wait, microbiology. He's the one who found out the ways to make wine. Look at him. He is thinking about what he's going to do next. Ah, oh, Sylvania, we do Action. Okay, typing macam laju sangat typing. Pandang depan, muka belagak. <laughs> Let me explain. The yogurt. The main starter culture in yogurt are lactobacillus, bulgaricus and streptococcus thermophilus. <laughs> Today. Um, so that's all. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> of microbiology bulletin. Stop.